Hi, and welcome again to Smart Flips. This is another video with the storage unit. My name is Mohammed, and I'm an online reseller. And recently I've been buying more storage units. So, uh, yay! <laughs> anyway, uh, it's getting cold in here, and the day is shorter. So, today I came in to pick up this unit. Uh, it's a small unit, it's a 5 by 15 and I bought it online for uh, $30 plus 10% uh, fee, $33 in total. Anyway, I just made it here a little late in the day, it's almost 6 p.m. Uh, good thing they have access 24 hours to this lo location, and I just got here to actually um, get the paperwork done and pay for the unit. And, uh, well, and I brought with me uh, my... Uh, <laughs> Uh, the, the the flashlight because I thought it was going to be um, an outside unit and it's already dark outside but uh, well good thing it's pretty lit up uh, but uh, I'm still going to use this so you guys can see what um, uh, can see with me as I actually open the unit and uh, figure out what's in there all right let's look okay now the camera does have does have its own, uh, its own light, but well, it's own light, but it's still okay. So, the pictures they did not show that much details apart from what you see here uh, in the front. The guy who took the pictures or the person who took the pictures didn't go inside, which is uh, actually appreciated. Uh, but uh, and that's why it went for thirty dollars. And the reason I bought it for that much, or the reason I even um, bid on it, it's because of the golf clubs. So I thought, well, it's going to be at least 30 bucks worth of uh, uh, value in here. Um, I remember from the picture, I did see this one. I'm still learning about um, uh, different uh, golf clubs and stuff. So like this one, I think I've seen it in eBay selling for like 20 25 plus shipping, $30. And also this so yay that is that is more what is this stuff i think it's all for softball training or something and yeah rolling glove rpg 74 12 inch yeah that could be worth some money um yeah the blinds here well they're like standing blinds uh they are not worth too much, but let's see. Oh, there's more than one. So it's one, two. Yeah, third one is damaged. Okay, let's try to go a little deeper in here. See if we can. Oh, there's something else. Yeah, I'm just taking a quick look inside with you guys, and I'll go back and get a table and have things set up so I can actually. Unbox stuff. Yeah, it's really not packed. Oh, I see more golf clubs in there. Wait, Let's see something else here. Okay. All right, this is <laughs> an interesting uh, can, I guess. Okay. Well. Interesting sign too. Uh, gas cans. Yeah, good thing they're empty. Oh, actually, this. Yeah, it's empty. No, empty too. This is empty. That's okay. It will make it easier to get rid of it. Uh, I don't think it's a brand. Usually, good brand of furniture, you will have some kind of stamp on the, on the sides. I don't see any, so... Okay, leave that for later. Okay, let's see some books in here. Fatal Tide. Uh, okay. Mm, okay. Looks like football shoes. yearbook or something okay oh this is a desk well looks like it's empty too oh it's missing the front i 
I think it's maybe inside the the other one. Oh, nice more golf clubs and more golf clubs over there too. And a case, huh? All right. Oh, there's some military clothing. Oh, yeah, pants. Uh, Alright, seeing some DVDs. I oh, can't really tell much. I see some more military stuff. I don't know if it's actual clothing or not. Anyway, okay, uh, give me a second. I will set up the table outside and start pulling things out so you can see what's in here. All right. All right, I'm back. Uh, well, just put the table down where I can actually put the phone so I can record and uh, let's start digging. Oh, I'm just gonna take this one out of the way for now. Looks like a nice grill, but I haven't seen the top yet. Not on top of it. Yeah, I've seen this, the gas cans. Uh, this messenger bag. No. And some clothing. Made in Cambodia. Okay. T-shirts now. Okay, we got ourselves a donation box. I'll put it aside here. This one looks like it's packed with personal stuff. Some pictures I'll have to put aside, some paperwork, Ouch. and the camera camera. Right. Yeah, the uh, every time I move the table a little bit, uh, the camera sliding off a little bit. Well, this is embarrassing. What are you going to do about it? Okay. Ah, oh, you can't really see me then. Uh, let's see. Anyway. Let's figure something different. Uh, this is all books. Paperwork. Uh, even the books here are not sometimes textbooks this is a work army package yeah I'm starting to think this is some military person stuff uh, to check all the personal items put them aside okay well have you seen the the, the glove and some weird trolls and a bunch of balls here. I'll say probably what is it seven big soft balls and another six of these. I'm just gonna put all the sporting stuff in this bag then. I'll have to look this up. I sold them before, and one time I actually just had like a box of baseball ba uh, balls. I think it was like 40 of them or so. I sold them on eBay for like $50 plus shipping. Yeah, nope. Okay, let's see. Yay, tools. Not the good kind. 
a couple screwdrivers. Mm, no, I don't think this is worth anything. Okay, yeah. So I'm not going to be showing you much of this box because it looks like there is just pictures of some kids and... Ew. See what this is? Ah, containers. Let's see. Oh. So it has like... Ah. Frank Thomas car. Oh, so this is like one of the collector's cards. Huh. Well, <laughs> we may be into something that's actually worth some money. Okay, so this is a Frank Thomas one. Alright, let's see. How many we got? Looks like there's more than one. Okay, mm. series. Okay, I need to take my gloves off because I can't handle paper. Even though it's, it's really cold in here, it's like 34 degrees tonight. Okay, this one is uh, Noma Garcia Para. Well, of course, uh, I'm not pronouncing them properly. I can barely actually get them. I don't know if you guys are able to see anything. Well, anyway, I'll probably take a better picture later. Uh, yeah, so my knowledge about baseball is limited to almost nothing. Okay, some uh, iPod looking thing. Maybe I should turn off this light. No, it's not an actual iPod. Oh, there's more. Another one. So we got four so far. Another two. Six. Four more. Ten. Ooh. Six more. That's sixteen. And it's really sixteen. I don't have to go through them probably to actually check. Seventeen. Ah, oh, this one. Let's make it nice. It's empty. No, card is here. Juan Gonzalez. Just doesn't have that rest of the stuff in here. Uh, let's see. Anything else? Nope. Personal stuff. Back on me. Playing cards, I assume. Lincoln, Lincoln Sense. Okay, let me move this stuff. I'm here to watch this. What is this? Oh, they were collecting money. Oh, it's incomplete. Let's see. Oh, this one has uh, quarters or times? Nickels. Eh. Oops, I don't know where this one fell from. Oh, looks like they have some. It's incomplete, but it's interesting. I'll have to check on the value of that. I mean, it's money. So, uh, this is all, <laughs> this is a return on investment, I guess, but um, I'll check if there is any value to the actual collection. Okay, 
This is from 1975 to 1983. Oh. That's a bit sign. This one looks almost complete. Yeah. It's missing some of them. But look at that. This is what is it? Silver penny? 1943 and 1943D. Hmm, that's unusual. Alright, put it aside. Put it aside with the good stuff. Okay. So there are more personal pictures here. And the VHS. The blank VHS. These the blank VHS I can usually sell with uh, uh, like a VHS uh, take, uh, player, like the reporter. Uh, what is this? America Reserve Force Defender of Liberty coin. I don't know what the value is that. And some army toys. Uh, someone was fully into army stuff. Okay. Let's go look for more stuff now. Okay, let's say I should use the actual drill so you guys can actually see something. Alright, it looks like folders, donation box, donation box, some blank papers, uh, stuff is not worth anything. Hmm, coach. Uh, nope, pictures. Let me put them in the outright of pictures. Power cord, yay! Let's please have some kind of computer in this unit. What is this? Cabinet making. Nope, it's gonna go to the thrift store. Sometimes I go quickly through the books just to see if something is hiding inside. Uh, like in this case, there's a personal photo. Yeah, that stuff should always put it aside. Uh, Joseph Wombo. I'm not sure I'm pronouncing the name right. Larry. Ooh, like a love letter or something. A long distance relationship is not easy. I just put this one with personal stuff. Okay. Uh, okay. What is this? Ohio State University. What is this? It's like a school package or something. Oh, no. Okay, so it's like a plaque for second plaque for the person who currently worked for Ohio State University and that was a ten year plaque. Okay, the Sony had uh, had the what is it? Uh, radio and C D player, car C D player. Okay. More personal stuff. I'll go through that stuff later, just to double check, make sure that there is no gift cards or personal stuff that I could uh, put aside for them. Well, this looks a lot like just trash. Uh, what is this? 400 meters? Oh, no, I think this is just some kind of curtain. 
Curtains are not worth that much, especially if you have just one of them. Uh, paper, paper, lost sock. Uh, and. Hey, Grand Theft Auto. Grand Theft Auto 4. And there's this Mel Gibson Apocalypto. Oh, I think this is actually. I think this is like a horror movie. That's actually worth some money. I mean, maybe like twenty, thirty dollars or something. Um, I don't. Sorry, I don't think you guys are able to see it. But all right, I'll have to look it up. Uh, okay, sprint of cell and yeah, this guy definitely loved anything army. Okay, in here, let's just see. nope, this one is missing. And there's a couple of DVDs here, Troy, Gladiator, yeah, it's actually out, yeah, DVDs are not worth much, okay, um, looks like an iPod cable, earbuds, hangers, worst kind of hangers, the metallic one is Really horrible. Okay, Arizona. Place that I have to decide. Nation. What is this? Tap out. American. Uh, what is this? American or arrogant? I don't know. Nope. Towel. Yeah, Under Armour. I don't remember what they call this type of bag. It's like a backpack. But it's not really that good. You can't really carry much stuff with you. Um, flame Biology. There's some kind of fun but no. Uh what is this? Uh acne. Okay, acne treatment. Go into the trash. A lot of fence. And the nickel. Okay. Guess I'm gonna keep aside. Place to get a, the nickel out of it. Uh, let's see. Let's take out the other. And more pens and choppies. And... Yeah, I think that's it for this box. Very interesting movie. And yeah, kitchen stuff. Nothing worth keeping. Okay. Let's see a belt made in the Dominican Republic. Well, someone at the thrift store doesn't have use for it. A VHS tape without. Sometimes I'm curious what <laughs> what will be inside, and then I'm like, mm, no, don't really care. Empty wooden box. Looks handmade. Fortunately, this stuff has really no value. Piece of a frame. Let's see some DVDs. Dukes of Hazard and Ocean 12, yeah, it's Ocean 12, yeah, that's the one with, uh, what's her name, uh, Julia Roberts, yeah, okay, personal stuff, 
personal stuff. No. No. This one is probably R rated. Not sure. Uh, yeah. This is going to be personal stuff. I always check the album photos because I did find some time, one time there was a, a $2 bill that was inside one of them and it was like a birthday gift or something. I was like, yay, lucky $2 bill. Oh, it's lucky for me now. Oh, they have some pictures of Paris. Mm, sorry. Let's try not to show you the actual person. They looks like, it looks like they went to Notre Dame. See the, the famous church that went into flames recently. Anyway, um, yeah, let's put this stuff here. Also, sometimes you may find hmm, Dave Stewart. Not sure if it's any good. Um, sometimes you may find like album photos are being uh, used like for cars, like cars collection or something. So this one's always worth. Taking a second look at them. Uh, paperwork, paperwork. Another belt. Okay. Mm. Nope, nothing. Just books. What is this? Uh, believe it or not. Just in book. Just books. First grade or something. Yeah, usually only textbook textbooks will have some kind of value, and it's college level textbooks. Rest of stuff, yeah, personal stuff. Anything, anything else is usually just now not valuable at all. Okay, where is this? It's an empty envelope. This was. Oh, so maybe he just broke it. <laughs> uh, I just tried to open it from the wrong side. Okay. Um, I'll well, put it with the other equipment. Some office supplies. Okay. Yes. Bible stories. Probably will have better use of that stuff. Okay, it's mostly books. That's why I'm just going through this stuff. Student package. Yeah. So I'm going through this stuff a little bit faster. And I'm trying to keep an eye on anything personal for whoever owned the unit so I can put it aside for them. I don't think it's blank CDs. And. Angels and Demons. Okay. Uh, yeah, RCA is not, it's not worth much. Okay. Another box to go. Okay, guys. I'm stopping the first part right here as the video is kind of getting out of hand a little too long. I thought this was going to be a short, um, a short expedition going through this uh, storage unit. Because it didn't seem too big, but there is definitely a lot, a lot of stuff to go through. Uh, well, um, thanks for watching, and uh, tune up for the next episode. And uh, oh, of course, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Thank you. See you.